What's going on guys, Robichun here, thank you so much for watching and we're going to take a look at my new first ever legendary item, yes, it dropped in Nighthold, oh my god, I am so excited, it's the soul of the Huntmaster, item level 1000, oh my goodness, at first I was like what is this, and then I take, take a closer look and it says legendary and it's like whoa you know what I mean and I should have known right off the bat since legendary items are orange wow I damn this was so random today I just went into raid finder and I'm trying to get everything done here for the first time and I'll show you my achievement I just got done with night spire not too long ago and I got I got the ring dropped from T. Chondrius, and yeah, that was insane. This is just crazy. I, I can't believe I got it. Like, damn. I'm just so happy that I got it. Like, wow. <laughs> All right, let's take a look at um, what we can get out of this. So, uh, it's a ring for your finger, and uh get all the cool stuff here stamina critical strike haste and mastery you got a prismatic socket I'm gonna have to do a little bit of research on that and see what kind of gem or whatever works well with this beast of an item and hopefully I can get something good here in the auction house I'm not sure how to go about doing that but if you guys can help me out in the comment section please let me know anyways uh, let's see gain one of the following talents based on your specialization. So if I change specs, this is what we got going on. We got Beast Fury, Bestial Fury for Beast Mastery, Marksmanship, Lock and Load, Survival, Serpent Sting. It says the unseen path reside in the True Shot Lodge. They are the watchers in the wild. They are the eagle on the, on the wind. They walk the lonely road. Shift right shift right click to socket you haven't collected this appearance it's a ring why would there be an appearance that's kind of stupid um trade skill master okay all right so my item level is at 896 and the highest ring i got right now is 900 dropped from the world quests of uh the originals so i gotta turn that in i just got the pants but I think I got higher. Yeah, 915. So, yeah, let's go ahead and add this guy. Oh my god, I'm just like so excited. 896. Let's go to 900. I'm just kidding. Alright, let's go. Oh, <gasps> dude, I went to 903. Wow, that is so cool. Yes. Yes. Dude, I skipped like so many levels. Like, I was at 896. I went up six levels. Yes. That is so badass. Oh my god. No turtles here. Wow, look at that. God damn. You learned a new passive. Bestial Fury. You haven't collected this appearance. I don't understand why. I don't get that. But oh well. Um Let's see, Bestial Fury increases the damage bonus of Bestial Wrath by 15%. Awesome. So I just gotta, gotta put, I gotta get some uh, Prismatic Sockets going here. I got actually, uh, there's quite a few of them. I'm such a noob. I honestly don't know how to go about getting equipment and things like that. But I'm just doing world quests and just kind of following my instincts. Now that I got a better handle of things here on the world of Warcraft. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching. I really, really do appreciate it. I'm so happy. I just went up six levels. That is insane. I've been working on that for the past uh, few weeks here, trying to get some cool equipment. But as you can see, my guy's not up to par with a lot of transmog, so I'm just having fun here. Thank you guys, take care, and we'll see you on the next one.